When it comes to disagreements, animals can be just as brutal as us humans. Like us, they can hold a grudge. And once wronged, it can be difficult to win them over. As the saying goes, once bitten, twice shy. And these animals will be sure to think twice next time they come across each other on the playground. From the dog who took on a porcupine and lost, to the polar bear who tried to befriend a sled dog, here are 15 times animals are jerks to other animals. Number 15. Mahalo, the dog who took on a porcupine. If you were considering taking on a porcupine, this Canadian dog might just offer you a word of warning. Don't. In fact, this guy's lucky to be alive after his altercation with the angry little character in the Canadian province of Saskatchewan that borders the United States to the south. Mahalo and two of his pals were out playing, minding their own business, when, lo and behold, their peaceful afternoon was interrupted by a porcupine. Obviously none too pleased about having its relaxation time disturbed, it set upon poor Mahalo and both of his chums. Unfortunately, Mahalo was the worst hit. He was left with a significant number of quills embedded in his head. In fact, if it weren't so serious, the look on his face would actually be quite funny. Stabbed with barbs all over, they even penetrated the poor guy's heart and lungs, and could have been fatal had it not been for his quick-thinking owner. Mahalo had to undergo surgery to remove the dangerous barbs. We can only imagine the next time he sees a porcupine, Mahalo will be making sure he gives it a wide berth. And who could blame him? Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or Slenderman will come from under your bed while you're sleeping. <laughs> Number 14. Polar Bears and Dogs Playing Polar bears are considered a dangerous predator, particularly when it comes to smaller animals. So when photographers saw one approaching a chained up sled dog, they thought the worst. Veterinary nurse Brittany Semeniuk and her vet partner were visiting Manitoba, Canada in the hopes they might be able to get some shots of the big, white, polar-loving bears in action. But whilst visiting Mile 5 Sanctuary, just outside of Churchill, they came across a scene that was so much more than they could have ever imagined. A massive polar bear was approaching a chained up sled dog, and the pair had no idea what was gonna happen. Firstly, it looked to be teasing the poor animal that was literally at the mercy of the bear. It couldn't get away, and Semeniuk said she was worried for it. Fortunately, all was okay. The bear appeared to be annoying the dog, but it was in fact attempting to make friends by nudging it with its nose and poking it with its big paws. To start with, the dog appeared to be slightly nervous of its much bigger playmate, but then it appeared to calm down and join in on the bear's playful game. These interactions don't always end the way this one did, however, especially when the polar bear's hungry. In fact, three polar bears were removed from the exact same location not long after this footage was filmed, so it just goes to show you how lucky this little canine was. Number 13. Silly Leopard Takes On Porcupine Just because you're bigger than your opponent, it doesn't mean that you'll win the battle. Well, that's what this silly leopard found out the hard way when it decided to take on a porcupine. The footage was captured by Art Van de Wettering, who was on a trip to the Kruger National Park in northeastern South Africa. One of Africa's largest game reserves, it has a high density of wild animals. <coughs> including lions, leopards, rhinos, elephants, and buffalo. Or the Big Five, as they are occasionally known. Van de Wettering and his family were nearing the end of their annual two-week Kruger vacation when he and his wife spotted a leopard disappearing into a culvert. Unfortunately for the leopard, the culvert was already occupied by a porcupine. As you can imagine, the altercation wasn't pretty, and the little spiky chap ended up the victor. 
Armed with a brilliant self-defense mechanism, the porcupine is a difficult opponent to outsmart, and the leopard will no doubt remember that in the future. Describing it as a once-in-a-lifetime sighting, Vando Ettering was just disappointed that his children hadn't seen it. They decided to remain at the camp, so had to relive it through the lens of the camera instead. Number 12. African Cheetah vs. Meerkats a young cheetah who's keen to make friends didn't quite get the reception he was expecting when catching up with a certain meerkat. Kinji is a friendly young fellow who lives at Cheetah Experience, a not-for-profit organization in South Africa. The organization provides a safe haven for a number of endangered and threatened species, including cheetahs, leopards, male lions, servals, caracals, African wildcats, wolves, a Siberian tiger, and meerkats. Being the friendly type, Kinji seems keen to get to know his neighbors, but when he comes to the meerkat enclosure, the reception is not what he was expecting. One meerkat doesn't appear to be keen on a visitor of the big cat variety and makes it immediately obvious that he isn't welcome in, around, or anywhere near the cage. Fortunately, Kenji isn't bothered. While the meerkat sees him as a threat, he just wants a little attention, and whether the meerkat likes it or not, any attention is good attention for this gorgeous guy. He rubs himself up against the enclosure while the meerkat furiously pushes him away. But its actions just serve to encourage Kinji as the fearless attacks are mistaken for friendly grooming. The cheetah is in no rush to leave and the poor meerkat is left confused, no doubt wondering why he doesn't get the hint and just leave it alone. Number 11. Tiger and Dog are best of friends. Cats and dogs aren't always the best of friends. More often than not, the cat rules the roost and the poor pooches just have to fall into line. Even us humans are often controlled by our feline friends. They certainly know who's boss. So it may come as a bit of a surprise to find that a big cat of the tiger variety has been friends with several German Shepherd dogs since birth. <laughs> In what many would consider an unusual bond, German Shepherds, Blackie, Hugo, and Jenny are inseparable from big cat, Surya. And now, Surya has a baby called Sunny, and the five spend their days happily playing at the Oasis of the Siberian Tiger in Senex, Slovakia. Oasis is a protected area that breeds Siberian Tigers and is where Surya and Sunny were both born. Lucia Zustakova, a visitor to the park, has captured spectacular photos of the group playing. An Oasis volunteer, Martin Simon, regularly takes videos of them together. Play is now part of their daily routine and can sometimes get quite rowdy. The boisterous animals play, fight, and chase each other in a game mirroring that of cat and mouse. But instead, it's a game of cat and dog. Number 10. Cat vs. Toy Tiger I wonder just how tough this Tom would be if the big cat he got in the ring with was a real one. Let's just say the fight wouldn't have been nearly as one-sided as this one is. He definitely has a mean right hook, but still, the domestic little Moggy would be no match for the deadly jaws of a real wild cat. That's for sure. In this hilarious video, the cat is giving a stuffed tiger toy quite the beating, as its owner makes matters worse. They can be heard quietly laughing to themselves as they make the tiger appear lifelike, moving it around and flicking its tail. This appears to anger the feisty feline even further as the ruthless chap rises onto its back legs and hisses before repeatedly punching the toy square in the eye. The YouTube clip has been viewed over 300,000 times, with viewers giving the cat all sorts of crazy nicknames, including Catsius Clay and a boxing champion. One thing's for sure, he definitely has some moves. Number 9. Cat Boxing Dog Who Wins? Call 911. This poor Labrador Retriever has a dog's life. Literally. His bad-tempered feline companion is giving him a hard time, and worse still, his owner's not doing a thing about it. In fact, she seems to think it's a bit of a laugh. <laughs> I don't think Storm would feel the same. 
If this was a couple of humans, Matt the cat would be arrested and charged with domestic abuse. Poor Storm just wants to play. But this cantankerous cat isn't having it. The misunderstood mutt is begging for attention, but Matt would prefer to have a cat nap. No amount of encouragement will persuade him, so the cat decides to get vocal. Unfortunately, the hissing doesn't work, so the tough Tom goes to town on the poor pooch's nose. He swipes at it time and time again, but rather than fight back, Storm seems to think the cat is playing. But boy is he wrong. After a flurry of slaps to his nose, Storm looks to his master for assistance, when really he should be dialing the nearest police station, STAT. Number 8. Sheep Gets Revenge on Cat If it's true what they say about black cats, this sheep could be in for a world of trouble. Unless, of course, he's not the superstitious type. In some countries, black cats are considered a symbol of bad luck, particularly if one walks across your path. This act is believed to be an omen of impending misfortune or even death. But the sheep in this clip isn't bothered by such hocus pocus. No, he's got more serious matters to attend to, like getting rid of this unwanted visitor for starters. Whether the little black kitten is a regular visitor or not, we're not sure. But suffice to say, the sheep has had enough of him strolling along the top of his pen like he owns the place. Not only that, but the kitten has the audacity to hiss and swipe at him when he's clearly just inquisitive and trying to introduce himself to the little black visitor. When it's time to take matters into his own hands, this sheep is a pro. He leaps into the air, nipping the kitten in the process and scaring the poor little guy half to death. The kitten quickly drops to the ground and takes off. I wonder if there will be a repeat performance. Somehow I doubt it. Number 7. Kangaroo Fighting with Unusual Partner A couple out walking through a kangaroo park close to their home got the fright of their lives when they came across a large kangaroo and a goat having a heated discussion. The footage shows the kangaroo had been minding its own business, picking around the undergrowth looking for food, when the annoying goat decided to pick a fight. Both animals were male, and neither was prepared to let the other win. Taking on an animal with horns takes a lot of guts if you ask me, but the kangaroo was pretty sure he could handle it. With their muscly and strong legs, they're a force to be reckoned with on a good day. So anger them and you're in for a world of trouble. Standing up to full height, this giant jumper makes quite the imposing figure, and the goat isn't sure he's made the right decision. The kangaroo quickly loses interest and hops off into the distance. Unfortunately, the goat doesn't take no for an answer and kicks things up a gear by giving chase. How their day ended, we're not sure, but you can guarantee at least one of them will be nursing a few injuries later. Number 6. Parrot Annoys Cat This footage of a cat and an African grey parrot is not only hilarious, it's relatable. The look on this cat's face is priceless. He appears to be incredibly annoyed, and it's easy to see why. Like a woodpecker, the parrot simply won't leave him alone, no matter how much the cat ignores him. If I could offer the cat some advice, it would be to just get the conversation over and done with. It certainly beats being constantly henpecked until you just can't stand it anymore. The parrot obviously doesn't get the hint, and can't seem to understand what the problem is, which seems to bother the cat even more. And as we know, cats and birds aren't typically buddies, so the parrot should be careful. He's testing this furious feline's patience, and it's pretty obvious too. Let's face it, this cat wouldn't do well in a game of poker. His expression says it all. Not that I can blame him. Imagine being kicked in the face, pecked on the ear, stared at and poked and prodded. I'm surprised this parrot didn't become the cat's dinner. When it looks like this is the most patient pussy on the planet, he finally takes a swipe and the irritating little gray bird flies out of claw's reach. That's the most intelligent move he's made all day. Number 5. Funny Brave Monkey Messes With Two Tigers Two little tiger cubs get a rude awakening while hanging out together one day when a playful young monkey drops in to say hello. Dangling off the branches above them, just out of reach, he plays a cheeky game of tag, occasionally high-fiving, pulling their tails, or even kicking them in the face. 
If these guys were fully grown, it would be a dangerous game, but they're not, and he's clearly enjoying himself. He's pretty quick too, which makes the clip even funnier. Must be incredibly frustrating for the wee cubs, particularly when he pops out of nowhere and teases them from a distance, only to disappear again. What great fun he's having, and it's certainly cheap entertainment for the cubs. His agile acrobatics ensure he's always kept just out of harm's way, and the little orange and black striped predators soon tire of his games, heading off for a well-earned nap. Had they been adults, these tigers wouldn't have been quite so keen to play. And let's face it, neither would the monkey. In fact, he might have even become their dinner. Number 4. Cat Duck Fight Tom Bonin. It's funny, they're playing. It is a well-known fact that the relationship between birds and cats is normally a complicated one. Most domestic and wild cats hunt birds and are frequently blamed for the diminishing population of various species of native bird. One of the most famous cat and bird duos would have to be Sylvester and Tweety. The fictional characters feature in the Looney Tunes and Merry Melodies series of cartoons, where Sylvester's often chasing Tweety and Tweety retaliates by playing tricks on the dopey black and white feline. But as we know, friendships can be quite surprising, and none more so than the pair featured in this clip. These two are the best of friends, and spend their days playing together, clearly not concerned that they're bred to be rivals. In fact, the duck is often the victor when it comes to their occasional disagreements. It plucks the cat's fur while the cat takes a swipe at its head. Even though the duck is clearly slower when it comes to running, it certainly gives it a good go. Neither is backing down, and according to their owner, they play like this most days. They're certainly an unusual couple, but hey, who are we to judge? Number 3. Monkeys Love Puppy the tiny little pooch in this clip looks like he's bitten off more than he can chew when he's surrounded by a large group of macaque monkeys. These monkeys normally inhabit ranges throughout Asia and North Africa and primarily eat seeds, leaves, flowers, and tree bark. Fortunately for this little guy, they are not meat eaters, because if they were, I'd be a little concerned if I were him. In this clip, filmed in the monkey forest Udub Bali, Indonesia, the monkeys seem to be fascinated with the little dog and are keen to play. One stands up on its hind legs and inspects the dog's ears like it's looking for ticks, or perhaps just making sure he's friendly. Several others come to join the party, and they all start jumping all over the dog. He's clearly a friendly little chap that doesn't seem to mind all the attention, which is fortunate given how many monkeys soon gather around him. Soon after, the tiny canine has had enough of his new playmates and heads off to find a more interesting game. Number 2. Annoying Fish Battles between animals are not only limited to land, they happen in the sea as well, as this clip shows. These two gill-bearing aquatic craniate animals have a fascinating way of settling an argument, and it's something many will have never seen. Lying on the ocean floor, they've had a bit of a falling out and have resorted to spitting at each other to settle the score. I don't know about you, but I'm not a fan of spitting. However, on this occasion, I can make an exception. It's just so funny. Each fish gathers up a mouthful of sand and proceeds to spit it at the other. What they're trying to prove is anyone's guess, but the result is highly entertaining. It'd be interesting to know how and why the battle started. They're clearly annoyed with one another. In fact, it's all quite heated. I wonder how long the unusual scrap lasted and how they decided who won. It's not like they'll be counting the grains of sand. A viewer's comment summed it up perfectly by saying, On the internet, people have flame wars. In the water, fish have sand wars. These two tiny fish are now Facebook famous and they haven't got a clue. They're probably still too busy spitting sand. Number 1. Crazy Goat Annoying the Dog Goats can be vicious little characters, so unless you're aware of their personality, it's often best to give them a wide berth. 
The dog in this clip has the right idea, and is just ignoring the annoying kid that's keen for him to play. And you can't blame him, really. He's probably fallen foul of this little fella in the past, and he's not keen to repeat the experience. Who knows? The little black goat is obviously bored and desperate for someone to entertain him. He's actually quite the show-off, and the big dog is a captive audience. Standing on his hind legs and attempting to headbutt the cool canine, the little goat doesn't quite get the reaction he wants. You've gotta feel a little bit sorry for the wee fella. Finally, the dog barks at him several times, but the goat still doesn't get the hint, and the harassment continues. <laughs> but today is just not his day and no amount of antics are gonna get this old fella to play. He's clearly had a big day and just wants to chill out. Fortunately, he's saved by the sound of a crowing rooster, and the goat trots off to see what all the noise is about. What a relief. Animals can be quite entertaining, particularly when it comes to their relationships with each other. Some are quite friendly, where others are arch enemies. Either way, when they come together, it can be quite entertaining, particularly for the viewer. I mean, watching a monkey teasing two tiger cubs or a leopard who thinks he can outsmart a porcupine is pretty funny, but they're not the most hilarious encounters, I'm sure. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time.